I'll show you how you can download apps on Windows 11. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. There are two different ways you can go and download apps on Windows 11. The first way is by downloading apps directly from websites. So if there's a certain app you want, then what you can do is go and search for that in a web browser go to that website and then go and download it. However, there is actually an app store for Windows 11 which we can go and use, sort of browse for apps and games. So let me show you that now. So what you need to do is go to the bottom of Windows and tap on search. And then what you want to do is type in the Microsoft Store, just like so. It should appear quite quickly, go and click on it. Then it's gonna go and open up like this and I'm just gonna go and zoom in this for you guys so you can go and see it clearly. So the first thing you'll need to do once you go and open up the Microsoft Store is go and sign in with a Microsoft account. So what you can do is browse the Microsoft Store without an account, but if you want to go and download an app, then you will need to go and have a Microsoft account, which is why I recommend signing in or creating one now. So to do that, what you'll need to do is go and tap on the profile icon in the top right. As you can see, it says profile. Now mine says RT as the profile picture because I'm already signed in. So yeah, click on that there and then there'll be a sign in button. If you don't have an account, tap on sign in anyway and you can quickly go and create one. And then what we can do is go and search for apps um, or browse for them. So what you can do is scroll down just here. And as you can see, we've got things like WhatsApp, iTunes, iCloud, so many to go and look at. And if there's one, a specific one you'd like, you can also go and search for it at the top. And there's a few different categories on the left hand side as well. So just as an example, let's say I wanted to go and get Netflix. All you need to do is go and tap on Netflix on the right hand side and then literally go and tap install like this. It will then say pending and it will firstly go and download and the download time shouldn't take too long, but it will vary depending on your internet speed. It will go and it's install itself and now it's ready. So it is going to see a lot easier to download apps from the Microsoft Store rather than sort of having to install them from third party websites. But yeah, now I can go and click on open and here we are, Netflix is now opening up and I can go and click on get started and go and sign into my account or choose a plan. So that's it guys. If you found this useful, please consider leaving a like. Peace.